Yes. I was born in 1988 and um, no issues in utero that my parents were aware of. And after birth, I was diagnosed with hypoplastic left heart syndrome. What happens in a normal anatomy is that all your blood from your body goes to your right side and your right side pumps it to the lungs and then it returns from the lungs and goes to the left side. Well, her left side is small, so what they did was, okay, you have a right side, a right chamber. We're going to make that work as the left chamber and so all of her blood essentially goes straight to her lungs. I have had two open heart surgeries. The first one was when I was six months old and the next one was when I was three. I try to kind of encourage parents who are really scared because their child has something wrong with their child's heart to do not limit your child. My childhood was very typical. Um, I have the best parents in the world and the doctors told my parents very early on to let me experience life and let me live and don't put me in a bubble. And so I did all of the things. I, I did cheerleading, I did soccer, and I never had anyone in my life tell me that I couldn't. And I never had anyone put the thought in my mind that my heart could stop me from that. A healthy lifestyle, exercise, those things are even more important for a patient who has congenital heart disease. My advice to parents with young ones with heart disease is to let them live their life. Um, but along with that, teach them about their body. Teach them what to look for, what feels right, what doesn't, and when to get help. Never assume you can't do something because you're an individual with heart disease. Um, we're capable of anything. It's just a matter of um, allowing ourselves to try and push ourselves. I, I think it's a good idea to just bring awareness to, about congenital heart disease. Um, congenital heart disease is the most common and is a leading cause of birth defects. One in a hundred or about 40,000 babies are born every year with congenital heart disease. So I think it's just good just to focus on that for a month and make parents know that they're not alone and that it can happen to anyone. And so I know a congenital heart disease diagnosis can be really terrifying and um, I think, and I've said this so many times, that the best gift I was ever given in my life is the ability to live. I think the fact that you've gone through um, heart surgery and that you're alive and well is a testimony. And so just take it from there and the sky's the limit.